What is up my viewer bears and welcome to today's video. Today's video marks the start of a new series I'm going to call Game of the Week. In this series you can expect me to review one game every single week that I think stands out of the pack. I tend to spend a lot of time playing VR games and so I decided that I would pick my favorite VR game of the week and showcase it on the channel. I'm not going to go into heavy descriptions about what the game is, I'm just going to talk about it, mention it, briefly what it entails, and then suggest that you guys go and get it. Majority of these games will be free so if you're looking for some great games to get at no cost this is definitely the place to do it. I'm going to try and upload one of these every Friday, but as you guys know, I have been very busy lately, so we'll see how that goes. If you guys like the idea of the series, please let me know in the comments below and hit that like button. And with that being said, let's jump into it. The game for this week is Grapple Tournament. It is currently in its beta stage on the Quest, however it has been released on PC. Because it is in beta, you are able to get it for free for a limited time. However, this does come with some drawbacks in the fact that it doesn't always have multiplayer hosting enabled, as well as it doesn't have all of its full capacity maps. You can currently just play on one map, and that one map is Spiral. However, that one map is insanely good, and you can get a ton of play use out of it without getting bored. The reason I chose this game is for one, the art style is absolutely beautiful. It's semi-unique, follows that kind of simple polygon, kind of artistic comic style, which is really cool, especially in VR titles. But aside from that, the movement has a lot to be conquered. You can use a grappling hook, you can jump, you can double jump, you move very quickly, each gun gives you a different movement speed, and on the fact of each gun, there are tons of guns. You got auto tracking guns, rocket launchers, shotguns, SMGs, deagles, there's so many guns and they're all super fun and satisfying to use. Picking up the guns is easy, you can find them all over the map as well as your one starter pistol that starts on your right or left hip. To pick up a gun, all you gotta do is run over and grab it, or you can use your grappling hook and actually grapple it toward you. On top of that, you also get a bow you have at all times that you can summon out of thin air just by pretending to grab a bow with your left hand to your right hand. The bow shots will actually bounce and do a lot of damage, however they're much harder to aim and hit with than your normal gun. One of my favorite features of the game is their idea of how to stop third partying. After you kill somebody, they'll drop about 50 HP that you were able to run and pick up. On top of that, you can also pick up shield at almost any location near any gun, as well as a bunch of health stations throughout the map. This means you're constantly at full health and all the fights feel fair. Even when multiplayer isn't enabled, you can still get a ton of play out of the single player. You can range from easy bots all the way up to insane bots. I personally would stick with hard if you want a challenge but still want it to be playable. I've played easy and insane and hard and I definitely thought hard was the best. Insane, although it is fun and challenging, can be a little frustrating as the bots have aimbot basically. They're basically aimbots. That being said, this game is an App Labs game, meaning you don't even need side quests to get it. All you need to do is search for Grapple Tournament Demo in your Oculus app and you should be able to find the game under App Labs. This makes it an easy install and for the low price of $0, it's definitely a must try, especially if you're into shooters. But that is going to wrap up today's video. Like I said, these are going to be super quick, basically me just showcasing the game, some gameplay in the background, saying what I liked about it, saying what it entails, and saying who it might be for. So if you're excited for this series and you want to see more, please let me know in the comments. I'm really trying to test the new waters here. I'm working on videos that might be bigger. However, I do want some smaller videos that I can make in my free time. But because I don't have a lot of free time, I want to try and make easier series. Unlike APK Wednesday, which takes a lot of troubleshooting and work, I want to do something like this, which is much easier to just kind of throw out all of my thoughts with some gameplay in the background and hopefully help a few of you out. With that being said, thank you to my members, you guys are absolute mad lads, my little lettuces, and my mama bears, your support helps out the channel tremendously. If you want to become a member, all you gotta do is hit that join button and you get a bunch of perks, one of which being your name at the end of every video. I hope you all have a good rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Bye. Smack.